Orip Somoherjo was an Indonesian general and the first chief of staff of the Indonesian National Armed Forces. He received several awards from the Indonesian government, including the title National Hero of Indonesia in 1964. Born in Perwareo, Dutch East Indies, Orip exhibited leadership skills from an early age. As his parents wanted him to become a regent, after elementary school Orip was sent to the school for native government employees in Magaling. His mother died during his second year at the school, and Orip left to undertake military training in Meester Cornelis, Batavia. Upon graduating in 1914, he became a lieutenant in the Royal Netherlands East Indies Army. During almost 25 years of service he was stationed on three different islands and promoted several times, eventually becoming the highest-ranking native officer in the country. Orip resigned from his position in about 1938 after a disagreement with the regent of Perwareo, where he had been stationed. He and his wife Roma then moved to a village near Yogyakarta, where they established a large garden and villa. After Nazi Germany invaded the Netherlands in May 1940 Orip was recalled to active duty. When the Empire of Japan occupied the Indies less than two years later, Orip was arrested and detained in a prisoner of war camp for three and a half months. He spent the rest of the occupation at his villa. On 14 October 1945, several months after Indonesia proclaimed its independence, Orip was declared the chief of staff and interim leader of the newly formed army. Working to build a united force from the fractured former military groups in the country, Orip received little oversight owing to irregularities in the chain of command. On 12 November 1945 General Sudirman was selected as leader of the armed forces, while Orip remained as chief of staff. The two oversaw almost three years of development during the Indonesian National Revolution, until Orip resigned in early 1948 because of the political leadership's lack of trust in the army. His health deteriorated, he was already suffering from a weak heart, and he died of a heart attack a few months later. He was posthumously promoted to full general. <laughs> 